Huh. Sounds like the Wells Fargo wagon. Uh, we'll go down and take a look. Holy crap. <laughs> you think they could have put it in a bigger box? Jeez. A surprise in every box. Fragile. Hmm, must be Italian. Wow, it takes up almost the whole stairway. Okay, let's open her up. Gee, he's a big one. Well, the box is big. And I'm sure it's in a case or there's a box inside of here. Kind of like a Dr. Seuss story. Oh. Hi, I'm Jeff Gailey, and I'd like you to try out my new Jeff My Pillow. Okay, I think you'll enjoy it. Oh yes, more stuff. All right, catalogs, papers. There's a box in a box in a box. Here we go. That's like a monkey. Come here. Uh. Hi, we're going to open this box. Woo! <clears throat> you probably saw it said Martin. Yes, it is. This is a Martin guitar. Uh, I forgot the model number. It's really cool, though. It's a, uh, it's a Martin. And uh, this belongs to Terry in Chicago. And we are going to hot rod it. This guitar side hasn't been played yet. I haven't played it yet and played it. And the people in the factory played it. I don't know exactly what we're going to do to it yet. But Terry is a lover of the hot rodded guitars. He has a Jim Ricky and a Jim Dandy. And there's videos of both of those. So let's see what we got here. Probably in a box. I mean, it wouldn't be right if it wasn't in another box. Okay, here we go. Brace out. Oh man, they do not want this guitar to come out of this box. Whew! There. It is a Martin parlor size guitar. Nice gig bag, real nice one. Let's see what we got here. I'm here. And more papers and more books. Somebody's been in here messing around. Yeah, see, this sweet water. Okay. What a cool size. Boy, it is pretty. It's sort of in tune. Uh, it needs to be set up. The action's not very high. It is a triple O a junior. Let me get the light. Boink. Martin. Okay. So, what we're thinking about doing, if you saw Kurt Cobain's guitar on the, his uh, Unplugged video for MTV, he played that, I believe it was a D18-E, and that was like a 60-some model. Uh, and it's a one-year guitar that had two pickups in it, selector switch, and three knobs down here. And we're actually thinking about doing it. I'm going to check the bracing inside and find out what we can do and what we can't do. And uh, he would like to put a pickup here. That's pretty. And put a pickup back here. But we don't know yet. So we don't know what we're going to do with it. Uh, 
kind of odd the uh, the end post they didn't put one in there now I don't know if they did that uh, probably so that you could put a sound hole pickup in it and run the cord out the back I'm just guessing that's what it is or put your sound hole jack in the back of it but they didn't put an end pin in it but they do put one here up on the neck so anyhow there it is the martin triple o junior and now we'll go find out what we're going to do to it y'all have a nice one